Hi, I'm George Northwood. Um, today I'm going to be buzz cutting my hair, as promised. All you're going to need is these clippers. It's perfect for kids, perfect for hot weather, and it's really quick and really easy. Let's do it. First things first, clippers. I've got these wild ones, I've been talking about them in other videos but um, detachable lead, really easy. I'm gonna put it on the shortest setting, this, this, this button at the side, you can move it. I'm gonna put it on the shorter setting. And I think I'm gonna start with a grade four, okay? I'm gonna do that, I'm just gonna do basically, the first step is I'm gonna do the whole head on number four. Okay, I've never actually done this on myself before, so, Okay, we're gonna do this. Woo! Oh God, it's gonna go really short. Or well, maybe I've done it too short, guys. Ah! That's quite a lot of hair. Um, okay, let's do it. No looking back, don't look back, just look forward, you know, it's done. I love a buzz cut. Okay, I'm gonna repeat. A lot from the previous video I did on a haircut, but, you know, hair grows, God, it already looks better to me. Hair grows in many different directions, so the best thing you can do is, um, you know, you'll see I'm going in lots of different directions because the hair grows, in, and some people have cowlick, so the, for the hair to cut, it has to go against the hair. If, if the clipper was going with the hair, oh God, look, you've got to see this, guys. She wants to get involved. I can't be on it. I'm not gonna have a buzz cut too. What do you want? Let Daddy have his buzz cut and then we'll play. So, as I'm getting back to business, I'm just gonna go in all the different directions over my whole head and just keep doing it. It's a really quite nice process. It's almost a bit like a head massage. And you can tell hair's coming off because you can hear it, you can hear the hair Come, and you just keep going until you don't hear any more hair. So go different directions. And guys, if you've, long as you've got this, as long as you've got this grade on your hair, you can't go wrong because the grade is the distance between your scalp and the clipper and the hair is the distance, the bit in between. So you can't go wrong. I mean, look, I mean, be careful that the grade doesn't come off because if the grade comes off, then you'll go right to the skin. Basically, guys, you know when it's ready because you won't hear it probably, but I can hear it cutting the hair. I can hear it like, you know, the sound of shaving hair. So as soon as I don't hear any more cutting, I know that it's done. So I'm just going to keep going. That's quite a lot. And do you know what's actually really good is I have, I've inherited quite bad hair texture. Sorry, mum and dad, but... You know, I have very, very frizzy hair and it's coarse and now it's grey. What they don't tell you about going grey is that your hair becomes more coarse as well. So not only does the colour change and you've got white hair, but then it, the texture changes. And I, my hair, just, the longer I grow it, it just becomes really frizzy. So by cutting it off like this, you actually eliminate all the frizz. And it just looks sleek and shiny and smooth. I love, I love a buzz cut. I actually love them on women as well, you know, when Cara Delevingne did it, I think it looked cool. I mean, you've got to, I feel buzz cuts on women have to look quite, for a woman to carry off a buzz cut, I feel like you've got to have a bit of a pixie-like face. Um, the beauty of hair is that it really softens your look, and so you've got to remember, by you're basically removing hair from your head, and so you're relying on your features. So I just have to say, if you have any... If you have anything with your face that you don't like, you know, you have a prominent nose or you have like, you know, just bear in mind that by shaving your head off, you are revealing more of your face to the world. The great thing is, is that if you're in an isolated situation, now's the time to experiment because it will grow. That's grade number four. I've just done the whole head. Now, I'm gonna get grade three. I've just done four. I'm gonna do the whole thing on four. Then I'm gonna do three up to about here and just leave the top. Then I'm gonna do two up to about here, so it blends. So really, because I'm gonna do two here, I don't have really have to bother about that bit. I'm just bothering with this kind of midsection. So.
And in my other haircut, in the long haircut, I was like always take it away from the head. With this, you don't have to bother. You just have to make sure that this middle bit is all of is a number three. That's great. Three. So midsection three. You could do all of it four, then all of it three up to there, all of it, but I'm just doing them section by section. Okay, grade three done. Grade two. Clip it on. And now grade two is just gonna be the bottom bit. Basically the hairline and the over the ears, only the bottom bit of the hair. So you can see I'm doing above the ear here. Doing all the hairline. So I'm gonna actually turn to the back so you can see what I'm doing from the back. And just do all the, do everyone's hairline grows really weird directions, so. Just go all the directions. So I've done the two now. Okay, grade two done, get very hairy. Uh, I'm gonna actually then go down to grade one, just for one tiny bit. Now I'm going to just show you how we connect the beard and the hair cut together, especially with the buzz cut. So we're going to put the one on. Now I used, I used no grades on my beard and I used a two here. So the bit in between is a one. So I'm going to get the one. And all I'll do with the one is, there's this little bit here. Don't, one is really short. So, you know, don't, you know, one is like almost like beard length. And this one, I'm gonna slightly just take it up. And this is quite a good tip, even if some people wear their hair quite long, but then this gets all a bit unruly. This is a really good tip, because these bits, if you let these go, you look a little bit unkept. Do you know what I mean? That's really good. Look at the blend on that, guys. Personally, I like to do then, I've done all the rest, I like to shape up the hairline with the scissors. So. As I keep banging on about is, look away when you're doing it, it helps. I like to go in Tidy up, because everyone's hairline's a bit funny. I'm, I really like this look on me because it's just really simple. I don't mind my features in my face. So I don't mind it being exposed. Um, I've got really frizzy hair, so for me, it just gives me like a real simple, I feel clean, I feel organized, I feel good. To be honest, if you're gonna do the, the hair, it's quite good to do the beard as well, but it's quite a look to buzz the hair and then grow a beard. I mean, thought about maybe, I thought about growing a beard at this time just because I've got the time, but because it's gray, I go a bit wizardy. Play around, I mean, this is the this is time to do it, I guess. Okay, guys, it's done. Let's make hair easy. Let's buzz cut the whole nation. Let's do it. Buzz cut your gran. Do whatever you want. Like, let's do it. Um, no, I'm really happy. I think it's great. I want to see your buzz cuts. Tag me in. Um, follow me. Please follow me. Subscribe. Ring the bell. Come on, comment below. Tell me what else you want to see. Let's do it. Let's make hair easy. I'm all yours. Till next time.